Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today is August 7th. It's Sunday. It's Muharram 9th. So the sunnah is to fast. Inshallah. I'm about to start class. I have my Medina as my uh, Medina Masjid as my background. And um, I'm waiting on my uh, students. This class is about to start in 10 minutes, but I don't mind having the zoom open in the meantime so that I don't forget because I'm gonna go ahead and plan my day. I am usually do it the night before, but I didn't. So I'm gonna plan my day and I'm also gonna do a brain dump. And um, I'll probably come back to you when I start my brain dump, inshallah. These smell so good. I had to buy some. They were just so fragrant. MashaAllah, look at the creation of Allah. Allah Akbar. All right, look at my living room. All right, I'm going to get ready for Salah. My Quran right there. And so I'm going to get ready for Salah, but I'm going to uh, start. I'm going to sit down facing the Qibla and uh, do brain dumping. Right, this is the brain dumping <laughs> prompt list. So what does that do? When you see the word, it's supposed to trigger something in your memory about, oh, do you have to do something about this and help you to brain dump? Because uh, sometimes brain dumping without help, um, sometimes we get blank and we don't know. So when we see the prompts, it helps us to like, oh yeah, 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 I have to do this. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so it's just like a trigger list. Okay, so that is, and that is also part of the planner, actually the intentional month, monthly planner, you get that as well. Um, without the stickers, because those are my stickers, but you do get that uh, prompt list, inshallah. So that is what I'm going to do on a random piece of paper. Bismillah. So one of the trigger, um, trigger prompts is over here it says happy about so what am i happy about i was actually happy to see this prompt um i also have fears and worries on the prompt but you know before i used to write down what i was worried about and afraid of and today you know i was like no there's nothing because whatever would have been a fear before um i'm just like has be allah allah is sufficient for me and so I'm not afraid. I know that he's going to provide for me. He's going to, you know, take care of me. I just have to basically um, touch the palm tree or, uh, you know, put the stick in the, in the water or, you know, I just need to do a little bit of something, tying my camel, and that's it. I don't have to worry about anything. And so happy, what am I happy about? Oh, subhanAllah. Definitely, definitely happy about going to Hajj. And so that's what I'm going to write down here on my on my brain dump list. This is my husband's cup, teacup. <laughs> I miss him. So I'm using it. Anyway, I'm having chamomile tea with um, turmeric and cinnamon and honey. That's the mix. That helps me to wind down. I love this quote. Um, I was thinking about it. And you know, it's not about the quantity. It's about barakah in what we have. Always ask for it. Sa, sa, sa. Sa, sa. Mm -hmm. sa. Good job. Encore une fois. Alif. Alif. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay, so let's start with ayah number 282, which is our first ayah. And inshallah, we're going to start with marking our rules as we always do. I'm so excited about this. This is the third year that is going on, inshallah, starting in September. But uh, the deadline to apply is August 24th. It is now open. I will put the link to the registration below. It's free. You get a free one-on-one -on -one, uh, lesson with me um, about how to read Quran, basically. All right, we're going out. 
and I wanted to shout out my student with her scarf. That's what I'm wearing today. A um, Nova, Nova, Nova. Anyway, I'm gonna go uh, and um, I'll try to put her her website uh, link, inshallah, and you guys can check her out and support her. Bismillah. Definitely support sisters who sell hijab. Helps us to be modest, right? Definitely. May Allah reward her. Assalamu alaikum. We're in blues today. <laughs> All right. This is our theme. Let's talk about it. Regrets. You know how you have people say, no regrets, no regrets. Well, you know, I thought about it. And I was like, I used to say that too, without thinking. But then I was like, no, no, no. There will be no toba without regrets. <laughs> so what are some of the biggest regrets in your life? This is really important in the life of a believer. And so this month in the membership club, we are learning how to manage our regrets, how to handle them, with, so that we don't go into one extreme where we ignore completely. Uh, we're like, no regrets. And so we're not repentant and we're not making uh, tawbah. And the other extreme is that we think we're never going to be forgiven. And it's like, you know, we don't hope in the mercy of Allah. So we, we're going to learn about that in this month. If you're interested, registration is open until the 17th, inshallah. The link will be below. Bismillah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh people today is august 12 let's see what the trivia says what is the meaning of allah's beautiful name al-latif oh mashallah mashallah this is a name that we studied in the membership club this month and actually the content will be replaced on the 14th in about two days with new name with a new name of a law that the sisters will study the members will have access to for a month um new class of the Dabur, new class about sunnah um a new challenge and a new theme so but this was the name uh, of our previous theme this is the name that we studied al latif al latif mashallah he is truly latif <laughs> alhamdulillah and the answer is the subtle the the what the be the be turn that upside down the benign the kind the subtle it's another way of saying it the kind the subtle so how is my friday today's friday how is my friday going it's going pretty well it's very very quiet actually um i have uh, yeah, I went to khutbah, alhamdulillah, read my calf, and now I'm working on, in Canva, I'm working on a resume. I haven't done one of these in so long. Uh, give me a dua. I haven't done a resume in so long. So, but anyway, and that's what I'm working on. And Asa is in about 18 minutes, so I need to um, kind of wrap up. I wanted to send it today, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to send it today because I do want to wait for Salah. Eh, let's try to do what we can in the next 10 minutes. I'm gonna put the timer on. Always put the timer when you want to work a little faster. All right, I really do think that um, there's some eavesdropping. I will not be surprised if there's some eavesdropping. Every time, like it happened so many times, I would be saying something and then I'll go and then random quote will be like going along with what I said. So my student was just saying how hard it was and how she was feeling like quitting. And uh, it's something that I know I have to kind of cheer her up and encourage her a lot because she can easily, um, you know, have the was was or have the negative thoughts of I cannot do it and stuff like that. And she's doing so well, mashallah, tabarakallah. But still, she doesn't see that she's doing well and she's only seeing the obstacles. So I just hung up with her from class. I go into my... Um, momentum 
and it says forget all the reasons why it won't work and believe the one reason why it will i'm starting to think there is some definite eavesdropping happening <laughs> this is a tip what you just heard you saw me i was not actually reciting i was auditing my recitation so and i it's a tip that i i grew a lot in my own reading that way and i advise all my students to do but very few of them actually do it is to record your recitation and listen to it very carefully audit it um also a new uh, video on Tejweed um, was published, Clear and Hidden Mistake, only for um, the students. So I will share the link in our groups, inshallah, for you guys to study it. May Allah give us tawfiq. I am also accepting coaching clients. Uh, and this is the end of this vlog. I pray you found it beneficial. Um, I know that I, I have to work on my sleep. That was one of the things that did not work when I did my weekly review. Inshallah, I may, may do a video on weekly review uh, soon, inshallah. There's one on morning routine coming up soon as well. Assalamu alaikum.